and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Open Tuner, guys. It's time to go over what you should be expecting for the Super Bowl promo. Now, as you guys know, it's probably going up around like Sunday or Saturday, right before the, the, the few days before the Super Bowl promo ends up actually dropping. Typically, the Super Bowl promo does end up dropping around like the 24th to 25th of January, which is a few days from now. And that's what I'm giving it to you guys now, so you guys kind of have an idea because the Super Bowl promo comes right after from the air promo very shortly after at that to be quite honest with you guys and it typically drops before the super bowl obviously because it works its way to the super bowl it's typically like a road to super bowl solos but i'll go over all the content as we get into the video hey guys if you're already to the channel make sure to go down below hit that subscribe button turn the naughty bell boys come join the family guys we're grinding out towards 20k we're working towards it we're not too far away we're only like 2.5 subs away which isn't that long it could take us if things go right by the end of february so let's keep grinding out guys i appreciate you guys who all come out every day and keep helping the channel grow and make sure to give this video a big thumbs up get this video to 300 likes and make sure to comment down below all the things you guys think will be in the super bowl promo so we do have that for the community down below in case you guys think i missed anything or there's some extra stuff that you're expecting for the promo now guys let's get into this video so first things first as far as super bowl promo goes when the super bowl promo initially does drop what's the first thing you want to do i like to always go to sets right and come over to sets you can see what is out at the time you go over to sets you see the super bowl set now there's gonna be a few things, right? So last year Super Bowl, Super Bowl was built into a few things. So the first things it was divided by was Super Bowl Past and Super Bowl Present. So the way that essentially works, Super Bowl Past is more along the lines of the uh, former Super Bowl MVPs, former Super Bowl heroes, some former Super Bowl performers, Super Bowl teams. So you might see like Tom Brady from like 2012 or you know something like that, or like. They had Jack Tatum last year, Keyshawn Johnson. I'll go through all that as I'll, I'll show you guys it all in Mudhead in just a second. And the Super Bowl present refers to this current Super Bowl. So at the current moment, it could be a mixture of anyone from the Niners. It could be the Seahawks. It could be the Packers. It could be the Titans. It really just depends. I'm recording this after the Ravens loss. So it really just depends on who wins all their matchups. But it will be any players from those teams, depending on who makes it. Now, let me take you guys over to money real quick, just so I can show you guys some of the players from last year, past and present. So you guys have that idea before I keep going on with the video. Right, so, here we got the Super Bowl pass. So, last year they were 97 overalls. We had Jack Tatum uh, from Super Bowl XI. I'm not the best with Roman numerals, so I can try to convert that for you guys. We got Keyshawn Johnson. We got Reggie White, Franco Harris, and John Elway. It's from all, all types of decades, like Franco Harris. This was a while ago. Reggie White, not too long ago. Keyshawn Johnson, not too long ago. As well as Jack Tatum, we got Dallas Clark, Rondé Barber, Rodney, ha Rodney Harrison. Then we got some of the lower ones like Marshawn Lynch. I believe this was the year when, yeah, this was the year when he was supposed to run it and they ended up throwing it and they got picked up by Malcolm Butler. Then Malcolm Butler who got the pick. They have plenty of things as you guys can see. They had 95 versions of them, which upgraded, I believe, up to those cards. Eli Manning. Now, they probably won't use the same players again, so they'll probably use different types of Super Bowls for the past ones. And then as far as Super Bowl presents, which is the next one that we have. These are going to be the other players. So last year was the Patriots versus the Rams. We had Edelman who won the Super Bowl MVP, which another thing, guys, we will be getting our Super Bowl MVP card, which typically is the first 99 overall look, first base 99 overall in Madden 20. So if you guys did open that bundle, which is a guarantee you guys a Madden 20 Super Bowl MVP card, you will be getting one of these. So last year, the way you got this was the same way you had to open up that bundle, which I did open. So I will be getting a 99 Super Bowl MVP. Hopefully it is not something like Julian Edelman again. That would suck to get a guy like that who was... Yeah, that just at that point in the game, like you didn't want to Julian Edelman. Although his stats were really, really good, not gonna lie, you just didn't want a Julian Edelman car for the most part. I would have much had rather something else. But this year we still have hope. There's still quite a few teams still in the race, so hopefully we get a great car. I mean, a running back would be cool. Although I don't, I don't know if that's what I really want, but it wouldn't be bad. So we got an Endama Kung Su. We got Rob Gronkowski. Why is there another Julian Edelman? All right. Uh, Marcus Peters, Jared Goff, Devin McCourty, Dante Hightower. This is just the current Super Bowl. So, going to be the Rams and the Patriots. So, I think you guys got the point of that. And then we also have the red and the blue team and all the other stuff. But I'm going to go back to the mad screen and start explaining all that to you guys in depth. So, we covered that. So, you guys see the past and the present. You guys kind of have an idea for what we're working with when it comes to past and present. Going to be a ton of new cards, which is why I've been warning you guys as far as what's going to be coming. Like, all this content. We're going to be getting all these overalls. Why it's going to affect the market. I've been, I've been going over that in plenty, though. You guys should understand that at this point. Now, as far as the red and blue team, now actually they incorporated something called the red and blue team, which was a pretty big deal for the Super Bowl promo. 
So pretty much you logged down, right? You went to solos. There was red or the blue team. The way these solos were composed of, you had to pick one team, and whichever team won more solo challenges was the team that got the overall increase. So let me go, let me backtrack now. So when you picked the team, you got the offer of like four four players. You got like Reggie White, John Elway, maybe more than four. I don't remember exactly. It was like Reggie White, John Elway, um, Franco Harris, and you could pick any of them. And they were like 94, 94 or 95 overalls. And if you had them and your team and you picked the right team that won, they would increase an overall. Now, I don't know if they were 93s and went to 95s, they were 95s and went to 97s. I don't entirely remember the exact overalls. But the point when it was really cool. Now, how do you know who's going to win, right? So the way it worked is the blue and red. So it was the Madden community who pretty much decided. So pretty much this. Let's say that I picked the blue team, right? Let's say 200,000 people play Madden and pick the blue team. And 300,000 people pick the red team. Now, when all said and done, the 300,000 people who played solo challenges under the red team name, they would have ended up winning or whatever because they had more people on their team that played it. So the red team would win. So their, their players that they picked would get overall increases to 97. They actually become really good cards. We would be stuck with the 95s. Now, vice versa, same thing if I picked the right team. Now, how do we know which one's going to win? Pretty much YouTubers usually band together. We all say we all advise our community to pick the same team. We're all going to we all pick blue this year, let's say. We'll all pick blue so we can all eat. We can all get our upgrades. I don't know if they'll do the same thing again, but that was really cool. They did that last year because it gave me a, I had a nice Franco Harris, like 96, 97 overall, whatever it was for the rest of the year, which was a solid fullback that I didn't have to buy. So that's one of the beauties of Super Bowl promo. Also, Super Bowl promo, there was a currency last year, such as Super Bowl rings. There'll probably be another currency because we didn't get a currency for the playoff promo. We didn't get a currency. We're not going to get a currency for team of the year. So I think I think usually Super Bowl is the next big promo. We get a team, we get a uh, currency. And as well as good solo challenges. Typically, the Super Bowl 12 promo usually have really good solo challenges. Like in years past, they've done like road to Super Bowl, like 5K, 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 and then like 50K for the, you play the Super Bowl solo challenge. You get like 50K coins. You get collectibles. In years past, I don't really do collectibles anymore like that. So I don't know what it'll be exactly this year. But there could still be some really cool stuff. The rings, there could be a blitz. There was a blitz last year, guys. So you can't expect that there may be a blitz because we did not get the Christmas blitz this year, which is rare because we got one last year. I thought it was going to follow a similar format. But the next blitz was the Super Bowl promo because I do remember having Super Bowl rings for a potential blitz. So I'm pretty sure there could be a blitz at this time. There should be one. We haven't gotten with the last currency promo. So we can at least hope. Now, as far as everything wrapped up, like Super Bowl MVP stuff, the way that uh, collectible works, I'll show it to you guys right now because I do have it in my binder. The way that collectible works is pretty much if you for all you that have it. After the Super Bowl is played, once they announce the MVP, this card will be updated as soon as they are ready to go. Now, I don't entirely know where I'd probably even find that, right? Do you, you guys even know where to look for that? I don't know where I'd even I'd even find that card, but I'll look for it while I'm talking. But So the way, like I said, it'll update as soon as the Super Bowl MVP is picked. The next morning, whatever, Madden will, Madden will announce it. Like, I don't know if it's going to be the exact next morning. Madden will announce it, and they'll let you know, like, oh, this will be, like, in two days. It'll be the next morning. I don't remember exactly how quickly Edelman came out. This is right here, Super Bowl. LIV MVP, so this will morph into a 99 overall Super Bowl MVP. So, I mean, I'm hoping it could be a ton of guys like Pat Mahomes would be cool if he makes it. Kendall Fuller, like a, a crazy good cornerback. If the Chiefs win in, the feed fence goes crazy. Um, can't even really think right now. Aaron Jones would be really good running back. Devontae Adams, Aaron Rodgers, Russell Wilson would be an insanely good one. I just hope it's like something really good. I hope it's not like something like stupid, like a Donta Hightower, like for the Patriots. Obviously, the Patriots are out, so don't kill me for that, but you guys get the point, like. Dante Hightower, slow middle linebacker. I just hope it's not a car that's just a waste. Something cool would be really, really awesome. Have it ready to go. It's going to be a great video when the time just comes, so I'm really excited for that, guys. Now, that pretty much wraps up the Super Bowl promo in bulk. The Super Bowl promo will wrap from, like, the 24th, 25th of January, probably until, like, the 2nd or 3rd of February. And then it's going to be pretty much coming to a close because then the NFL Honors comes out. And Super Bowl doesn't really have much else to offer. We will probably get some Super Bowl LTDs. Some guys who play good in the Super Bowl. Hopefully they do that this year because they have not given us any playoff LTDs yet, which is really unreal because we're already in the and the division is almost over. And we still haven't gotten one from like the wild card round, which we usually get some LTDs per round. Kind of upsetting we haven't gotten one yet. But we're still holding that hope. There's still three more rounds. And we have the rest of the division, the rest of the conference, and the rest of the Super Bowl. If anything, at least give us some Super Bowl LTDs. That'd be really cool to make up for that. But the Super Bowl promo should be really cool. Out of the whole month of January, my favorite promo is probably Team of the Year and then Super Bowl. Playoffs is usually my last favorite. NFL Honor is one of my favorite out of all of them, but that's more February. It's like the first three days of February, so it's kind of January, but it's not. But guys, it is better for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy it. I hope this helps you guys out knowing what's going to come to Super Bowl. Let's see, I know this video is helpful for people who have never played before, so you don't even know what to expect. And people who have kind of played before, so you don't really remember. And people who just need a refresher because you didn't play in depth last year. Hopefully this helps any of you guys out. And if you are into the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Turn the naughty bell, boys. Come join the family. Get to 20k as quickly as possible. 
possible possible comment down below if you guys need any help with anything super cool related hit me up on twitter and make sure to give this video a big thumbs up can we get this video to over 300 likes that'd be greatly appreciated thank you guys so much for watching enjoy the rest of your day i'll be in another country but hopefully i'll get back to you guys need help so i'm out see you in the next video peace